Hi, I'm Willie with Willie How Technology. Thank you for coming to my channel. Thank you for being here, and I appreciate each and every one of you. And what we're going to deal with in this video is we are going to deal with the process of finding a an admin username and resetting the password in Unify. If you don't have credentials and you don't have access to the email address that was set up for the admin, I mean, there's a dozen different reasons you would need to do this. You take over a controller, you inherit a controller, whatever. You still need to know the usernames and passwords. So let's take a look at that process. Now, I did not invent this process. This is a process that's been out there on the community, but I thought it was worthwhile going over the commands. Mike D., who's a support engineer with Ubiquity, actually posted these instructions. So I will um, leave a link to this in the description. But let's, let's take a look at this. So we're going to connect to Mongo. We're going to find the administrators. And so for each administrator in the database, this command prints that information. So the information will look something like this. Then we will run the make password command to create a new salted hash of a password. And then we will paste that into this command and run it. It's, it's pretty straightforward, pretty simple. Now, if you've never run this before, you may not have this make password utility on your Linux um, your Linux box. So uh, I will put, if you are on Linux, you'll have to do a sudo apt-get install who is. That will, this will install the, uh, will install the uh, make password utility. So that's the first thing if you're going to do this on Linux. If you're going to do this on Windows, um, off the top of my head, I don't know which utility that you would use. They probably have a make password for Windows. You just have to Google that and find out. So let's get down to this um, real quick. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use this notepad because it makes it easier to uh, copy and paste the commands. Now this is the ultimate command that we are going to end up using to reinsert our password into the database. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this whole thing and make sure that you get everything down to the uh, apostrophe that ends this. We're going to paste that in there. I do have word wrap turned off, but it's important that this command is structured like this. You have to have all the brackets, all the parentheses, all the colons, everything. So just copy and paste it from this, uh, this post. So now what we're going to do is we are going to connect to our Linux server. And what we're going to do is we're going to come over here and we're going to copy the command that's going to show us all of the admins in the database. And I have a lot. And we're going to pretend this API user is the user that we need to set the new password for. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run the make password and oh, that's what happens when you got fat fingers. It's going to prompt us for the password. So I put in what I want my new password to be. I'm going to grab this salted hash. I'm going to go back over here and I'm going to replace the salted hash that is in between the quotation marks. That's the only thing that I'm going to replace there. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here and the username is API user one. You'll want to enter the username exactly as you see it on this on the screen. So API user one. Now I'm going to take this entire command I'm going to copy and I'm going to paste it in and I'm going to hit enter. And now you can see that it matched one and modified one. So now that user has the new password and I can show you that for a fact. All right, here is our unify and I'm going to put in the new password that I set at the command line. And you can see that I am now logged in to um, this is our uh, our rolling 
uh, password demo. So it does work. And it's really straightforward. So if you need to do that, the link is down in the description. I want to thank you for watching this video. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe. Please comment and share. Please follow me on Twitter and Instagram. If you want to talk to us on Discord, the link is down below. Uh, the link to our patron channel, our Patreon, is down below. You can become a patron. If you need IT consulting, best practices for wired and wireless networking, voice over IP, um, IT security, uh, web development, things like that, go ahead and go to my website down below, the willyhow.com, and fill out that contact form, and somebody will be with you as soon as possible. If we can't help you, we'll get you to somebody who can. And if you want to buy any of the gear that I use in the lab, I do have Amazon links down below. Once again, I truly appreciate you. Thank you for being here, and as always, I'll see you in the next video.